So Deshaun Watson gets suspended six games. Um, People are going to look at this as a win for Deshaun Watson, and frankly, it is. Deshaun Watson, because of how his his contract was figured out, only is going to lose $300,000. That's it. Now, we say only, but the truth of the matter is, uh, it is only when you're talking about, what, $240,000? Two hundred fifty million dollars, because they front loaded the contract. They understood how to go about it. Well, guess what? Deshaun Watson and the Browns got over on the NFL. Explain this to me. Explain to me how a guy named Calvin Ridley bet fifteen hundred dollars on a parlay legally when he was out, and he only well got a year. No gambling's different, man. All right. All right. You had two dozen women make allegations against Deshaun Watson. This wasn't a bad night in a bar. This is two dozen women. Now, I would go the other way, too, and say there were no criminal charges. I would. I'd go the other way and say, look, every, basically every one of these but two, and I say but two, and that sounds so idiotic and so asinine, got settled, settled, mind you, settled. And yet Deshaun Watson walks away with a six-game suspension. Think about Trevor Bauer. Think about this. Now, I I don't really understand this. Um, I know there are always extenuating circumstances, all right? I, I only, I understand there are. To me, anyway, the extenuating circumstances make the difference. And I always say there's a backstory. Listen to what Trevor Bauer got. 324-game Major League Baseball suspension. Two years for non-criminal sexual assault allegations. They didn't put Bauer on trial. They didn't put Watson on trial. Watson, six games for 30 women's non-criminal allegations. According to Clay Travis... Bauer's suspension will cost him over $60 million. Watson, $300,000. Is that unbelievable? How about Watson refused to sit out or refused to play last year? The Texans said no one would trade for him. They paid him a full salary. You could just sit out. That was Watson's choice last year. It's unbelievable. Look, it's nobody's fault. What you did was you put it in front of an arbitrator, and the arbitrator said, that's what we're doing. Now, you kind of knew this was all coming down last week, right? You kind of knew because, well, friend, or yesterday, because the NFLPA basically said we cooperated with everything. And in cooperating with everything, we're not going to appeal. And we hope the NFL doesn't appeal. I don't know what the NFL is going to do. I assume that if they appeal, they'll be called racist, I would assume. I mean, that seems to be the ongoing onslaught on a day-to-day basis. Anything that's said anytime, any place is racist. So I assume that is something that they will have to look at, I assume. But the truth of the matter is, man, Deshaun Watson, I don't know if he got away with something or he didn't. I just know when you look at Calvin Ridley's sentence, I just know when you look at Tom Brady got four games for deflating footballs a little bit, this dude had 30 women, and then they went over and tried to sue the Houston Texans, which the Houston Texans settled. As long as you settle, you're good, right? Kobe Bryant settled. He was good. He's a star. He's an icon. He's a girl dad. Fine. Deshaun Watson settled. He only got six games. I don't know what the hell Trevor Bauer's lawyer was doing. I don't know what the hell Calvin Ridley's lawyer was doing. I got no idea what their two lawyers were doing. But my God, man, you got some bad lawyers, you two guys. You got some really bad lawyers. Deshaun Watson sat out a full year, got paid, His deal. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. Now, I have no idea how the Houston Texans just went along with that. I have no idea how the Houston Texans said, you're not playing, you're not getting paid, you're cut. Well, we want to get something for them. Good for you. 
or you're not cut, you're put on some type of commissioner's list, or you're playing, you tell me. I mean, at some point, there's got to be a law or a rule, not a law, a rule that can defend teams against this. I remember when Debo, or what the hell is his name, Dabo Sweeney told us, Deshaun Watson's Michael Jordan. Yeah, okay, right. Deshaun Watson doesn't want to play. Michael Jordan always played. Deshaun Watson's got all these allegations. Maybe Jordan did, maybe he didn't, but they certainly weren't public. We get sold a bill of crap constantly. If I were women, if I were a woman, I'd be pissed. I'm kind of pissed, and I'm a man. Well, I'm not. It's hard to say you're pissed. Like, it, it, because it doesn't really concern me. What I am is, I'm just amazed at the world that we live in. The NFL will come out and say, hey, look, we're all about women. And then you look at this and you go, really? 